Good afternoon. My name is Rich Nass, and I am the Brand Director for the Embedded Division of Open Systems Media. I am here today for our five minutes with David Kleidemacher, the CTO of Green Hill Software. Hello, Dave. How are you? Great, Rich. Thanks for having me today. My pleasure. My pleasure. Okay. We have five minutes, so let's get right to it. All right. What's the single biggest challenge that an embedded, uh, an embedded developer faces today? The single biggest challenge that embedded developers face today, without any question, is managing software complexity. Uh, there's always these new demands for bells and whistles, and you have new challenges with security and privacy. And what it all translates to is my systems are becoming more complex, so how do I get my project done on time, and how do I do it in a way that, uh, that's going to be reliable? Okay, let me throw you a curve there. Uh, with that same answer, what does open source mean? I mean, you know, is, is it more complex, less complex, harder, easier? Um, I, I think it's orthogonal. You know, so there's different kinds of open source. Some open source things are very simple and easy to use, and some open source things are more complicated and harder to use, and you have to find the right tool for the right job. Okay, fair enough. Okay, so now a much higher level question. Um, if you could do this all over again, what would be your course of study? Would you go into the same field that you're in today? <laughs> Uh, you know, I would definitely, I definitely like the field I'm in, which is, the, is uh, you know, it's in the computer field, Internet of Things. I think it's a very exciting area. I would change that, but I would certainly study. A, I would definitely do a different major. So I was a computer science major, and my view now is that a lot of the things that you need out of the computer science major, like software development and operating systems, things like that, you're going to learn kind of along the way, or maybe as a minor. And some of the the theoretical things in computer science aren't particularly practical or, or useful in, in, in real life, in my opinion. So I would do something like electrical engineering, computer engineering, and get more of a basis in hardware, which I think is much harder to learn um, on your own. And, you know, the software parts you just pick up, again, as a minor or along the way in your, in your own spare time or on the job. So that's what I would do differently. Okay, fair enough. Okay, so then along those same lines, What's the most important thing that an engineer needs to know that he's not going to learn in college? Um, okay. All right. The number one thing, and it really took me, I'd say, almost 20 to 30 years to really understand this, is if you, in terms of being successful in, in your career, there's, there's the obvious things that we all, I think, are, are, are taught from early on, which is hard work, dedication to your craft, things like that. Uh, but the thing that you really are not taught early on is, who you know and your, and your ability to network and, uh, and expand your horizons in terms of uh, uh, what other people are, know and, and learn from them is just as important as the book knowledge and, uh, you know, the other technical knowledge that you can gather over the years. So it's who you know just as important as what you know. Very good. Okay, and then one last question. You have kids. Would you encourage your own kids to get into the engineering field? I, I, I would and I do. Uh, my daughter is currently a freshman in high school, and she is in this uh, engineering academy in her high school where they, they participate in that first robotics project. And I think it's a really great way for young kids to get involved in doing things that are exciting or interesting and learn a lot about the things that they'll need to do in the future. Because, again, Internet of Things is going to be everywhere, so I might as well start learning it now. Very good. I thank you for your time. That was five minutes with David Kleidemacher, the CTO of Green Hill Software. I am Rich Nass, the brand director for the Embedded Group at Open Systems Media. That was great, Dave. Thank you very much. Hey, Rich, it was fun.